what's up you guys it's me Odir aka the overview back at it again with another video i'm working on the batman spoiler talk but a little thing a lot of stuff has been going on this past couple weeks i got to move into a new apartment new floor kind of i'm still trying to settle everything in the set is still the same with a few differences uh i have a new room new access to space i don't even know i was gonna sound this after this recording but yo a little bit of echo in my room but anyway Cap uh, not the Captain Marvel trailer, but Miss Marvel actually had the trailer released today for Disney Plus right after Moon Knight and a bit in between Obi Wan Kenobi. I'm excited for this, but here's the thing, because this is my little introduction to who Miss Marvel is. I know she's a new new character. Like if I could name anybody off my chest, I could say Miss Marvel, but I would think of Carol Danvers Miss Marvel with the black suit and the S. But um, this is technically not her. This is the new version of Miss Marvel, Kamala Khan. I don't know too much about her, except except that she has stretchy powers and that she was a lead in the new Avengers game. Most people know her. I don't know her per personally, but I am kind of excited to see how the show turns out. And as we get started, here's my reaction to the new Miss Marvel trailer. In three, two. So we're getting into the comic book panels. It's almost like that Spider-Man whole going okay, so first Yeah, off, it is. The I aesthetic. Say, I get it. You get what? High school. Kamala. So it is going to be like Spider-Man whole going to friends at school. Cute. She thinks I'm some kind of weirdo. You are okay, that's kind of cool. I like the comic that it came up. That she's thinking like Sorry. a kid. But like Peter Parker you're almost. staring out the window in your little fantasy land. Okay, that was cool. I like that. Kamala, the Captain Marvel was suit. Already? Really? Homage. Like, do I have to figure out my whole future? Yeah, she is a fanatic of it's Captain really Marvel. Nice. Maybe they're right. I spend too much time in fantasy land. That is not to you. A little proto suit. It's not really the brown girls from Jersey City who save the world. That's a fantasy too. So her powers come from the bracelets? Does something happen to you? Yeah, you know why? Did you powers? Come on, love. What does it feel like? Cosmic. Okay, this is giving me some Green Lantern vibes. The way she's moving I with the rings, kind of the life. bracelets. But I never imagined any of this. Do you know what you are? Okay, the fist. She got it. Force field, so yes, she is using Green Lantern type powers. June 8th. The little suit. It even got the sash. Okay. Hmm. Not too bad, but um. Hmm, I feel like some people are gonna get mad about this. That her powers aren't the same as they are in the comics because she has the stretchy powers, almost like Mr. Fantastic. But now they switched that to more of like bracelets or rings. I don't know. With the MCU and the way they did Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings, I don't even know if these rings are even rings or bracelets. But anyway, her powers are basically bracelets that are almost like the willpower of the Green Lantern of the Green Lantern Corps. Where she can make anything, the giant fist, she made a little force field and little pieces for her to walk on. Which I did see in the in the Disney Plus um, Marvel Studio Day, whatever that thing was called a couple months ago. That you see her walking on something that she wasn't flying. I I know it's going to be six episodes. It might not be a thing for me. Because I'm excited for Moon Knight, which is coming out. I've seen pictures of She-Hulk. I'm not so sure about what that's going to be like. But still, Miss Marvel's not one of my new, new heroes that I'm fond of. But I hope to see whatever's going on next. And that'll be all for today. Be sure to subscribe, like, and keep a lookout for the Batman video. Because here's a little thing. I was in the midst of doing the spoiler review until I found out that I had to, I got access to come up here and do this personally. I know it's going to be a stretch to reshoot the video again because I already had my thoughts and everything recorded that I didn't finish. But I do want to give my own personal thoughts since I did get to watch it again. And I do want to give a couple thoughts on some things I didn't catch the first time. And I want to improve on what's been going on lately with the new news that's been going on around the DCEU, Batman and the whole Warner Brothers Discovery thing, I do want to give my input on that. As for right now, see you next time. Bye, guys.